Ever feel like you're stuck in a rut? Like no matter what you do, you just can't seem to make any progress? Like you're pushing a giant boulder uphill, but it ain't budging? We've all been there, feeling overwhelmed by the sheer size of our challenges. But what if I told you there's a way to move that boulder, one pebble at a time? It might sound too simple, but it's incredibly effective. That's the magic of Kaizen, a fancy Japanese word that basically means continuous improvement. It's a philosophy that focuses on making small, incremental changes. It's not about making big, scary changes overnight. Instead, it's about breaking down your goals into manageable steps. It's about looking for those little things you can tweak, adjust, and improve every single day. These small changes add up over time. Think about it like this. You wouldn't try to run a marathon without training, right? You'd start with small, consistent efforts. You'd start small, maybe with a walk around the block. Gradually, you'd build up your stamina and endurance. Then you'd gradually increase your distance, a little bit at a time. Each step forward is progress, no matter how small. Kaizen is the same idea, but for your work, your life, and everything in between. It's about making steady, continuous improvements. So, are you ready to ditch the boulder and embrace the pebbles? It's time to start seeing the power in small steps. Let's dive in and explore the world of Kaizen together. You'll be amazed at how these tiny steps can lead to big changes. Now, some of you might be thinking, Mike, what's all this talk about pebbles and boulders? Why are we even discussing this? Just tell me what Kaizen is. I need to know how it can help me. All right, all right, settle down. I'm getting there. Let's take a deep breath and dive into it. Kaizen is all about making things better, little by little. It's a philosophy of continuous improvement. It's about finding those inefficiencies, those bottlenecks, those little annoyances that slow you down and figuring out how to make them smoother, faster and more efficient. It's like fine-tuning a machine. And the best part, it's not just for big factories and corporations, it's for everyone. Kaizen can work for anyone, anywhere. Whether you're a mechanic, a teacher, a stay-at-home parent or even a student trying to manage your studies better, or even the President of the United States, though I ain't holding my breath on that last one, Kaizen has something to offer. There's always room for improvement. No matter who you are or what you do, you can benefit from Kaizen. But why bother with all this continuous improvement stuff? What's the real benefit? Well, for starters, it can make your life easier and less stressful. Imagine a smoother workflow and fewer headaches. It can also boost your productivity, improve your quality of work, and even make you more money in the long run. Who wouldn't want that? Sounds like a pretty good deal, right? It's a win-win situation for everyone involved. So, let's roll up our sleeves and dig into the nitty-gritty of how Kaizen actually works. Let's explore the steps and strategies to implement it effectively. Now, I'm not going to lie to you folks. Kaizen ain't always sunshine and roses. Like any good thing in life, it's got its pros and cons. On the plus side, Kaizen can lead to some seriously impressive results. We're talking increased efficiency, reduced waste, improved morale, and a whole lot less stress. Plus, when you empower your employees to speak up and share their ideas, you create a more engaged and motivated workforce. But let's be real. Change can be tough. Some folks are resistant to new ideas, and even the smallest tweaks can feel like a major upheaval. Plus, Kaizen requires a long-term commitment. You gotta be in it for the long haul, folks, not just a quick fix. So, how do you find that sweet spot between embracing change and keeping things running smoothly? That's where the real art of Kaizen comes in. It's about finding those small, incremental changes that make a big difference over time. But enough about the theory, let's get down to the nitty-gritty and see how Kaizen actually plays out in the real world. We'll explore real-life examples of businesses that have successfully implemented Kaizen and how they've navigated the challenges. From small startups to large corporations, the principles of Kaizen can be applied universally. 
So, buckle up and get ready to dive deep into the world of continuous improvement. Because at the end of the day, it's all about making things better, one step at a time.